Good morning, everyone. Big Buck Steve here from Edge of the Gather and Attitude. Huh, what, Dave, what are we doing with this shit? All right, so hey, this stuff is uh, is going to Justin Best. So Justin Best is one of our $25 patrons. For the last two months, I've missed him on this the uh, randomizer spinoff. Um, granted, uh, his uh, Patreon money uh, did come in, come in like a day late, but I usually wait till the third to do it anyway. So it... Honestly, like it's my fault. I did, and I told and I told him, this, and I ac I actually gave him my phone number, and we talked. And I said, I I said, Justin, this is my fault. By the way, this is MTG Mythic Hunter, Justin Best, and um, and I said it's my fault. I am so sorry, dude. I I totally missed I totally missed it, and uh, I will make it up. So the way I'm making it up, I'm gonna crack this bundle for him. And you're like, well, a bundle doesn't make up for it. Well, maybe this does too. So I, I told him, I go, listen, dude, I'm going to give you a double masters two for X Alter. altar. This is, this is the one, the same exact one I pulled from the nine packs I opened the other day. So whatever's in here, plus the Forexian altar, Justin publicly, I am sorry for missing you. I really am dude. And I, and I hope, I hope this makes up for it. So, uh, there you have it, man. Uh, I will send, and I will send all this out to you, you know, as per the norm and there you have it. So. And that, that was a miss. And uh, there was also another person on there, um, Neil Trevena. Everybody, you know, I was like, how'd you miss Neil? And I go, I, and, you know, and, and Neil hit me up on email. And, uh, and Neil's a great guy. Obviously, everybody knows his story and situation. And I said, uh, Neil, you got to trust me. Next Monday, we're doing something. <laughs> so you, everybody here will understand on Monday why exactly. And and I promise, I promise that uh, you guys will get it. You guys will get it. So there you have it. But uh, Justin, yeah, I told. Hey, look, it's a bra. It, a total miss on my part, and uh, I am very sorry. Wow, lightning bolt, man. I think it's worth like a buck or so. Put that off in the cool guy pile. There we go. And okay, there we go. And anyway, so yeah, there you there you have it. There you have it. Okay, Nira, Wild Mage, yeah, Tavern Brawler. And oh, okay, wow, we did get a nice foil. Okay, Rosa, there we go. And Blade of Cells. Ooh, Elman Starf. Full art, man. That's not bad. That's pretty goddamn hip, dude. We'll, we'll, we'll check out the price there at the end. It's not bad, dude. That is not bad. So, but uh, anyway, guys, listen, speaking of Patreon. So, for those who have been a patron for a while, A, thank you. And B, understand that when you're a patron, that thing is so cute, man. I love that thing. Uh, oh, that's an uncommon. Uh, anyway, the, understand that when patron hits, it hits between it hits in the first seventy two hours of the next month, and it's for that month. So, like for if for instance, somebody could actually get ooh nine fingers keen. I actually like that card. It's not worth a lot, but I I, I do like it. Um, somebody like, for example, say if they hopped on, on the 15th of April, they're not paying for April. Okay. The, the money doesn't hit in April. The money hits the following month within that first 72 hours. So it would be May 1st, 2nd or 3rd. Does that make sense to everybody? So you could actually kind of juke the system, lightning bolt again. It seems like javelin of lightning, uh, comes before that card. Uh, wow. Holy frickin' artifact. Holy shit. Okay, Bane, of, Bane Lord of Darkness, sure. Uh, okay, Gorian, Wise Mentor, not bad. Elder Brain, alright, there we go. Master Chef. Huh. Look at that, it's Editor J. Anyway, um, moving on. And I, I'll fix the, I'll fix the piles here in a little bit, guys. So yeah, like, you, you can, like, actually get into box breaks and stuff like that. And I am telling you how to juke the system a little bit. Beautiful art card. Gorgeous art card. That's amazing. And uh, anyway, so you get on, and then the next month rolls around, and you don't pay. But you've gained all the all the, the benefits of, of Patreon that month. And then someone will say, hey, like, hey, you didn't send me a monthly card. Like, well, hey, you know you fell off. Yeah, but I paid for April, you know, you know, like, it, to pay for May. Like, no, that's not how that works out. It you 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 can come in under that current month, and oh my god, that is our freaking list card. Get the hell out of here, man! 
You can come in under that month, but you're you don't you didn't pay for anything. All you did was reap the benefits of, of Patreon. You know, for for that month. And then the next month comes around, you drop off the system. And you go, oh, okay, yeah, hey, let me get back on. So you get it back on in the middle of May. And again, you don't pay for anything. You can get it to box breaks. You can do all sorts of crazy stuff. And then the next month comes around, and you don't pay, and you drop off again. And then you come back on in the middle of that month, and you get back on Patreon. And it's just a repetitive cycle. So I, I want everybody to understand that. If you hop on a paper in the middle of the month, you're not paying for that current month. That would that would be a waste of a month. You pay you, you, the next month that comes around, you're you're going to be paying for that month. That's what the randomizers are for. It's for the current month. So I hope that makes sense, to everybody. Okay, Monster Manual. We're, we're not doing too good here. I I keep I keep uh, buckshotting over here, but I I just feel the need to explain this because I think there was a confused fan slash patron. Who we explained the situation to. I'm like, hey, dude, listen, it, it, you've been on and off for almost four months, and there's not there has not been one there's not been one penny dedicated to Patreon, yet you're reaping the pay, the the benefits of Patreon. And he kept going on with it, and I'm like, and I talked to editor Jay. I'm like, Jay, I'm like, I'm showing him like all the all the info. I go, this is what this is what I'm seeing. I'm like, we're not getting it through to him, and Jay's like. Yeah, he's like, I, it's listen, you have to make that call, man, on what you're going to do. And he just kept, like, bringing it up and bringing it up. It wasn't really belligerent, but he just kept bringing it I'm like, I don't think he's understanding. So I just shut him off. I blocked him. So for that for that fan slash patron, I, and we did lose a fan. We lost a sub for sure. But we didn't lose a patron because he never paid. But the last statement, one of the last statements he made was, well, I saw that everybody else was getting free stuff, and I just wanted some of that too. And I'm like, that just kind of summed up everything right there. And I'm like, son of a bitch. You know, <laughs> and I, my intuition was a little right on that one. And it was just the way he said it. I'm like, ugh. Like, listen, we're a generous channel. However, patrons pay into certain things where they get cards, can pay into box breaks, pay into battles, free battles as well, like every third month or so. And the opportunity to win some packs and cards and uh that is gorgeous art by the way and of the like but they pay for that opportunity so by giving it to someone that's someone that's just a fan or a sub you're taking away from the people that are that are paying into the show and we don't want to do that and and i hate talking about this but it has to be talked about so everybody understands like you know what is going on and to that person i hope now that they understand I don't think they will, though. I don't think they will. Porn of Valhalla. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. So, I, I, yeah. Anyway, guys. Um, yeah. This was, and again, this was for Justin. Uh, MTG Mythic Hunter. Justin Best. So, Justin, let me uh, let me organize this stuff real quick and uh, see what we can do for prices on this. Stand by, guys. And we're back. Okay. Justin. Yeah. We're going to be opening that, too. We didn't get too much. This is all we really got out of here, man. There was not a lot. So, not to leave you flat, but it, it, and it, and it goes out to everybody out there, too, that, that's watching. So, that was just a horrible, horrible, horrible freaking opening. But I will send you this. I will also send you the Phyrexian Altar, and we're just going to open up New Catena. So, yeah, long and short of it, like, so, for example, Justin's like, hey, D Dave, I wasn't on the randomizer again. This is the second month in a row. And I looked at it. I go, oh, my God, dude, I, I didn't transfer you on the Excel spreadsheet. Two months in a row. Like, it's just an honest mistake. It happens. And I told him, and I, like, I actually called him. He actually talked. And I said, I, dude, a thousand apologies, you know. He's like, no, it's okay, you know. And so, he didn't know I was going to do this. He didn't know I was going to open this stuff up. He thought I was just going to send him to Phyrexian. So, and uh, it's same with Neil Trevena. Neil actually hit me up on email. He's like, hey, boss. He's like, I, I didn't see myself on the randomizer. I said, ah, Neil, trust me. This, there's a reason on it. You have to just wait till next Monday. He's like... And he's like, all right, you know, he didn't say anything, but, you know, Neil, my credit is good, guys. We all know this, all right? And I don't say that in a bragging way. I say it in a way, like, where I, we really do for the community quite a bit, and it's for you guys. We, we don't we don't have an issue doing stuff. This one was like, like, I went on Patreon and saw the three months of zero, 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 zero. You know, well, there was actually four zeros because it was actually four, it was actually four months. And then again, a couple of the last comment and him, he kept it up. He kept like, 
he's like, you know, like, well, you know, Dave, you know, but like, it's, listen, and now you're starting to question my integrity. And I was like, nope, nope. And not to mention the fact we've been burned really bad here before. So I was, I, I don't think it was intentional of him, but I am starting to smell a burn coming. And there we go. There we go. Herb Rask. There it is. Heretic Praetor. Not bad, dude. Not bad. Okay. And I, I, I'm going to get into the good stuff now, guys. I'm done talking about that. But I just wanted to let everybody know, you know, if you have that type of issue, hit me up an email. Hit me up with a comment line. I'll leave it right on there. But when it gets to the point of harassment, I'm going to shut you off. I'm going to shut you off because our integrity is good and we do good things here. That's all I'm going to say about that. All right. Getaway car. Broker's Ascendancy. It's not actually not bad. And, oh, Mysterious Limousine is our full art. So, okay, the, the, the Urbask was really, really good. So, all right, hey, uh, Justin, again, uh, I am 100% sorry. I will get this out to you right away. And, yeah, it, I'll make sure that doesn't happen again, and you'll be in the randomizer. And, I again, I hope this makes up for it. So, all right, guys, listen, until next time, much love. Thanks for tuning in, and thanks for watching. That's all, that's all I got to say about that. You guys are amazing. You guys are the ball sack, and uh, I don't know how to, else to rightly say that. And for the patrons, the greatest love in the world, and we'll show you, and we're going to show you the greatest respect in the world. You all know this as well. All right, guys, listen until next time. Deuces, much love.